recognize that music. Where'd that music come from? I don't know. Okay. Oh, come on in one last time, gang, as our hero, Peter Cushing, makes his plan to capture the Wolfman. Don't miss the exciting conclusion coming up in just a couple minutes. And coming up right now, we have a special guest from our audience to plug the Seven Hills Home Days. What is your name, huh? Beth Picklemeyer. Beth Picklemeyer? Yes. And you are Miss Seven Hills, 1988-1989, right? Mm -hmm. This is okay. it, huh, Beth? This is it. This is it. <laughs> so, plug Seven Hills Home Days coming Tell up. Tell us what we're going to see there. Oh, we have our 5K marathon run. We have jail bail with the proceeds going for MS. We have our beer garden with the proceeds for the burn unit, fun, games, prizes, and rides, Dick Goddard. and the Dick mixed up Goddard. Hills Oh my goodness, worth the price just to go there and see Dick. Ted Locks, Jim What is Dick going to do? Judge? Is he going to judge the contest? MC. Okay, and, and uh, Ted Lux, Ted right. Alexander. Ted Alexander. Jim Szymanski. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're all going to be there, right? Everybody. Guys have all good faces for radio. That's right. Now. <laughs> Are you going to be there to crown the new... I certainly will be. Queen, and next year you're going to be Mrs. Seven Hills, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, right. yeah, that's <laughs> Seven Hills. Home days, rides, games, food, fun for all, July 20th to the 23rd with a lot of celebrities, radio and TV, including Dick Cutter. Thank you, honey. Thank you very much. Nice hand. Right. The entire audience is from Seven Hills. There they are. That's right. And now, before we get back to the very exciting conclusion of Legend of the Werewolf, Here's a very exciting adventure of Fallacy Island. Well, there they go, Tattoo. Another satisfied group of people who had satisfied their fantasies on our island. You are amazing, boss. That is true, Tattoo. Uh, boss, you are always giving people their fantasies. Why do you do this? For the money, Tattoo. How do you think I got my new Cordoba with the rich Corinthian leather seats? AM, FM, stereo, Magfield's power steering. Boss. Uh, yes, Tattoo, what can I do for you? Boss, I want to have my fantasy. I want to be tall, just like you. You want to be tall, like me? <laughs> I have never tried anything like that before. Uh, how much money do you have? Six thousand dollars, my life saving. Okay, I'll try. <laughs> But I'm not quite sure I can do it, but for uh, $6,000, I could uh, buy another Cordoba with rich Corinthian leather seats, AM, FM stereo, mag wheels, power bar. Ah, oh, yes, tattoo. <coughs> Here we go. Oh, oh, uh, uh, I have to go back to the house now, tattoo. Boss! Boss! Come back! I want my money back! Boss! I had to Ella! Don't leave me like this! Boss! <laughs> Everyone's been calling me, Arsenio. Who's going to be on the show this week? Listen up, guys. Hit it! Jackie Collins! John Forsythe! Lucy Arnaz! Stevie Ray Vaughan in Double Trouble! Howie Mandel! 30-somethings Polly Draper! Weird Al Yankovic! Carrie Hamilton! Steve Miller Band! And 10,000 Maniacs! It's a wild week, and it all starts off with James Ingram, Mandy Patinkin, and Jessica Hahn on the next Arsenio Hall Show. Monday at 1 a.m. on TV8. At New Center 8, we believe the people who cover Northeast Ohio news best aren't the ones who grew up rooting for the Cowboys, but the ones who spent their lives cheering for the Indians. People with a history here, a future here. People who grew up here, or plan to grow old here. People proud to call this home. Cleveland's news, Cleveland's pride, Cleveland's own New Center 8. Lighten up. Come to Shaker Square's Lighten Up Performing Arts Festival Friday, July 28th. Let over 300 clowns, mimes, puppeteers, storytellers, dancers, and jugglers parade and perform just for you. Put more fun into your summer. Come to Shaker Square July 28th at 7 p.m. For more information on this event and the special performing arts conference, please call 252-5650. 252-5650. Twenty years ago, leukemia took the lives of enough people to fill a ballpark. But today, more people are surviving, thanks to research by the Leukemia Society of America. 
Hi, I'm Gary Carter. Join the team that's striking out leukemia. The Leukemia Society of America. We're closing in on a killer.